Well, the unemployment benefits situation is very, very fluid. So today we're making this special video for you to give you an update on what we know about different states in these United States and how they're all dealing with the PUA, the Pandemic Unemployment Assistance Programs. And I'm gonna share with you what we know about the states and uh, we got some feedback from some readers who are actually getting some of the some of the benefits, some of the money. And stick around. I'll share with you my exact strategy to get my PUA benefits here in California. Hey everybody, it is Jay Crater with the Ride Share Guy. There you go. Nice new logo. Love it. And so let's talk about unemployment benefits. Let's start with a little background. So independent contractors, what we are, you and me, the drivers, we typically do not get unemployment because our companies, companies like Uber and Lyft and Instacart and DoorDash and Postmates and Caviar and Uber Eats and the whole gang, um, we, they don't pay payroll taxes. So there's no money that's going into an unemployment fund. We're not paid with a W-2, we're paid with a, a we're shown a 1099. That's our proof of, of revenue. So in the past, we've not been able to get unemployment benefits because we're an independent contractor. But then on March 27th, the CARES Act passed, and that uh, allows for us to actually get unemployment benefits. And not too bad either. For 39 weeks, um, we can get a certain amount from each state. Each state's a little bit different. Here in California, it's 167. Some states are more than that. Some states are less than that. That's for 39 weeks going back to the first week in, in February. And then we also get $600, and that's for the four months of April, May, June, and July. So that's some significant amount of money. The problem is most of the states are not uh, equipped to handle independent contractors uh, because normally what the uh, unemployment offices do is they confirm your employment with your employer. Uh, but since... Uh, Uber and Lyft and those companies aren't providing any information, uh, That's we're a whole different kind of animal. So each state is like working really hard to get caught up. And what we're gonna go over now is how different states are doing uh, in getting caught up and actually getting money out into our hands. So number one, unemployment by state. As you can see here in the headlines, it says some gig workers are getting zero in unemployment benefits. I am one of those gig workers. I went ahead and applied about a month ago in the state of California before the PUA uh, system is set up, thinking I might be able to get in uh, with standard unemployment, but I was told I am entitled to zero. Then I appealed. Um, that didn't work either. So let's see which states have now caught up and are now accepting and paying out uh, benefits. So the first one we're looking at here First, we're looking at a map, and this map shows uh, the green, and the green states are those states that are currently paying out uh, benefits. And I'll give you the list in just a second. And then you can see uh, the, the purple, those are states that are also starting to pay now because at the time of I'm recording this, which is the 27th, um, those states were online as of the 24th. All the gray, all the gray, not not happening yet, not happening yet. So what do we see? States that have started uh, paying benefits are Alabama, Colorado, Iowa, Kentucky, Louisiana, New York, Rhode Island, Tennessee, Texas, and Utah. And then states that haven't started paying out yet, but they've started accepting applications are North Dakota, Pennsylvania, Vermont, Massachusetts, Washington, Maryland, and North Carolina. So if you're in one of those states, good for you. Things are actually happening. For those of us who are not in those states, such as me in California, we're kind of in a holding pattern, waiting for the states to get, uh, get us integrated into their system. Or in the case of California, they're creating a whole new system, uh, which is actually supposed to go live tomorrow uh, to accommodate independent contractors. Number two, what are our readers sharing? So what I wanted to do is share some comments and some uh, emails we've received uh, from our readers uh, verifying that they are in fact getting benefits. So first we see here it says uh, 
Spacey Nooner. Illinois is good to go. Just apply, call a bunch, then fax 1099 or 1019 tax summary if made less than 20K. Funds available in Illinois right now. And then we see a little further down. I got mine PUA benefits a few days ago. It was, it was easy, just to answer a few questionnaire. Didn't have to send 1099, nothing. Massachusetts, um, great. And then we see another uh, Dave Kaiser. I'm in Missouri and got mine today, along with the $600 per week. They back paid two weeks to me. That's awesome. And then just today I received this image uh, from somebody uh, in Pennsylvania and it shows what their website looks like and it says file a PUA claim right there online. And here's an email we just got today and it says for Illinois, unemployment for PUA is up and running since April 15th. So there's just another confirmation that things are running smooth in Chi-Town. That's awesome. So congratulations to all those people. And for those of us who still uh, can't even apply yet, uh, it's a good sign. It just means things are starting to happen, right? So if other states are doing it, um, you know, it's coming, it's coming. So don't, don't lose faith. Number three, what to do if you can't wait? Look, it's been almost three months since I drove uh, a lot of drivers just can't wait a long time without making some money, without getting any of these benefits. So we continue to recommend uh, Instacart because we've got some, some of our uh, readers have done really well with Instacart. Or you could do DoorDash. DoorDash, of course, delivering food, not as much uh, integration with the public. Or Postmates. Postmates is another uh, good service that we can recommend. Um, any so, kind of driving where you can do delivery is going to be a good option for you. And we've got the link uh, just down below. So if you want to do uh, Instacart, DoorDash, or Postmates, the link is below. Just click on it and you can apply. We have heard that some cities have waiting lists. So uh, apply as soon as you can and find out where, where you can have uh, an opportunity to get to work. Number four. One question we get asked a lot is, well, can I get unemployment even though I'm still like working for Instacart or, or DoorDash um, or Postmates, right? Well, technically, yes, but it's really your call. Look, if, if you are a W-2 employee right now, um, that means you're working for somebody and you're, you're classified as an employee, then no, you're not going to be able to get unemployment benefits because your unemployment department will be able to see by your Social Security number that you're currently working. So that's not going to work. Um, it may work at first, but they're gonna catch you. Now, if you're working as an independent contractor and you're trying to get unemployment benefits for not driving for Uber and Lyft, I don't see how they're going to figure out that you're actually doing that other line of work. So I suppose you could do it and kind of like double dip, right? So you're making money by working for Instacart or DoorDash and you're also collecting unemployment. It really comes down to your integrity and if you feel okay with doing that. You can do it. I don't really see how you're going to get caught because those companies are not reporting anything. Um, so it's, it's really your call. Think about it. See if you can live with it. And, you know, desperate times call for desperate measures. So, so what are the key takeaways here? Well, the wheels are, are slowly turning, right? Um, I shared with you like 10 states that are currently paying out and another handful of states that you can apply and the rest of the states are definitely, you know, starting to move. What's my strategy in California? Well, tomorrow, tomorrow supposedly, the new website is supposed to be operable and I saw that the hours that people can apply for unemployment starts at 2 in the morning. So my alarm is going to be set for 1.45 because I want to get in the front of that line. I think if you wait till the middle of the day, so many, literally millions of people are going to be, you know, accessing that website and there's a good chance it's going to crash or have some technical difficulty. So I'm going to hit it really, really early and I will share with you exactly how that works out for me with some screenshots. So we've got some instructional video about that for those of us who are in California or for some of you that are in other states where you want to get at the front, uh, the, at the tip of the spear so that you avoid some of the problems with so many people applying for the benefits. The other key takeaway here is 
Plan B, man, this is a, such a good time to get to work on your plan B. I am creating a whole new business um, since I've got this downtime, and I invite you to do the same thing. You know, the, you got time to focus on yourself. There's not much to do. There aren't a lot of distractions. This is just a great opportunity to uh, figure out what you really want to be doing, what's, what you're passionate about, what you can get excited about, what you can wake up happy about doing, and start making that a reality, uh, especially once this money starts coming in. You know, and you don't have to be quite so stressed about money coming in and you got this time, uh, seize it, seize it. This is a rare opportunity uh, with a lot of, not as many distractions and uh, time, uh, time to focus on yourself. So that's my key takeaway here. All right, be patient, it's coming and uh, we'll keep you informed. I wanna thank you very much for watching this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Um, I hope you got some valuable information. If you're in one of those states that's starting to pay out, congratulations. And uh, that's really awesome. All right. If you have not subscribed yet to our YouTube channel, please subscribe. Uh, join our team. We'd love to have you as part of it and keep you up to date on all of this government assistance uh, that's getting offered to us, the Rideshare drivers. This is Jay Crater uh, with the Rideshare guy saying thanks so much. You go out and have a great uh, and grateful day. Bye for now.